All right, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back. We're playing Super Mario Brothers 2. Uh, here we go. Oh yeah, I forgot those uh, select player screen. We're going with uh, her over here. All right, here we go. Here goes nothing. Oh yeah. I forgot about this uh, weird uh, effect that I had on the level design here. Pretty sure, yep, you can get on top of them and ride them, I guess. That's what she said. Got a cherry. Pick up the cherry. How do you uh, pick this up? Oh, there we go. How do you throw this? Oh, that works. Oh, that's, that's fantastic. Uh, I got hit. There we go. I haven't played this in a while. I think the last time I played this game was on the... I want to say Game Boy? Right, it came out for the Game Boy. That's, I know that's where I played it. That or I just... I'm not remembering correctly, but... I must have played one version of it, I guess. I don't know. I think you go in one of those uh, holes over there. Or you just go up that vine. Oh no! The shy guy. Oh, don't tell me. Oh, okay. I, I thought I had to like restart the whole thing. That'd have been really unfortunate. Let's pick up the cherry. All right, let's go up here. All right, let's go over. Oh no! Kind of screwed myself there. And. All right, let's get rid of those guys. The star! This is the first time I ever ran into, like, the star and Or at least, uh, get to see the star in a video game. Or at least in the uh, Mario series. I think that's the first time I ever got to use a star as a power-up. I don't remember. All right, here we go. So now we're going up here. Let me, uh, watch out for this... Ladybug, like whatever that is. Come on. There we go. Oh yeah, I used to call these leeches. I don't know what they are. That's what they look like. There we go. Damn, people back in the 80s must have, like, some really good patience to play these games. So part of me wants to, like, speedrun the crap out of this game. But another part of me is, like, doesn't want to be patient. Oh, no. Okay, alright. I see what I'm supposed to do here. Let's go up here. Fall on this dude. Use him and go up here. I think we're close to where Bird Birdo is. Birdie? That one dude with the big ass mouth. There we go. I believe I'm supposed to like grab his uh eggs or whatever the hell that's supposed to be. And just launch him at him. Oh wow. Keep on like jumping off. There we go. And boom. One more, one more, one more. There we go. And then I pick this up. This orb. And I enter this uh, mouth. Such a weird way to exit a level, but hey, I do that in real life. Alright, we're going to choose uh, Toad, I guess. Alright, we're on level 2. Oh, wow. That is, that is incredible. That is a great way to start out the level. By dying. Alright, we got to... Let's do this bastard's magic carpet. Come on. Come on, you freak. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Give me that. Uh-oh. 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 That was a close call. <laughs> Dig it. Yeah. Hey, when people say that. Alright, what am I supposed to do here? I think there's a key or something. Do you have the key? <laughs> like he's like struggling for his life. 
I'm guessing it was one of these pots. Oh, wow. Game over. That's unfortunate. I guess. I don't think I have any other choice here. I guess I'll pick Luigi. Alright, here we go. Oh, my goodness. All the way over here again. Yeah, people had a lot of patience back in the 80s. I don't have that type of patience. I mean, I'll watch a three, four hour long movie, but in video game form, I don't think I could... I can't be that patient. It took me like a whole decade just to beat this game back in the day then. This is like the Dark Souls of like games in the 80s, I guess. This is bullshit. Oh, wow. Yeah. I get screwed over. Well, I'm done playing this. Later.